This instructional video is designed to show you commutators and how to determine the value of a commutation relation. Commutator simply requires us to test AB minus BA, where A and B are operators. And in order to actually do this, we'll need some test function. So step one is to set that up. Step two will be to evaluate what we have as a result of the setup. And then finally, we simplify and figure out the value of our commutator. So in this case, let's consider the commutation relationship between first derivative and second derivative. So in order to do this, A, then B, acting on some test function, and we'll subtract B, then A, acting on the test function. So now, that's the first step, setting everything up, just making sure that we've properly identified A and B and the suitable test function. The next step is to start simplifying. So this first part, we'll leave operator A out. And we need to show the result of operator B acting on the function. That's going to give us f double prime for the second derivative. Minus, in this case, we leave operator B out. And show the result of operator A acting on the function. That's going to be f prime. And now we carry out this step. So we will get f triple prime minus f triple prime. And that's going to be zero. As a result, this is what would multiply the function itself, and that's what we'll use for our commutator value. And as a result, getting a value of zero for the commutation relation between two operators means that these two commute.